Yo, what up everyone? Amir Rahim here, owner of Rappin' and Snackin'. Getting into another product showcase. Make sure to hit me up on Instagram and TikTok at Rappin' and Snackin'. Subscribe to the channel, all the obvious stuff. Appreciate y'all. So we're gonna go ahead and do a product showcase here on my higher learning press kit. Picked this up on eBay for around $20 some time ago. And uh, just wanna go ahead and show it. So first off here, uh, Owen, you know, Ice Hue, Bus Rhymes, they're in it among other people. But we got... um. First off, this Columbia Pictures casing right here, little folder. You can see the logo. You can see it. It pretty much it shows. Um, it shows the pamphlet right here, just so you can kind of sneak through, see what it's about. Got the Columbia Pictures on the back right there. You got my fing fingerprints right there too. Boom, boom. Uh, spine. Nothing's written on the spine. You got the front, and then let's open this sucker up. So Columbia Pictures logo there again. You got the window, and then right here we have kind of like this, kind of like a little synopsis, little plot action. Boom, boom, higher learning. Got it all stapled up. And yeah, you know, you got some production notes, etc. I'm not gonna go ahead and do a slow scan of everything. If you guys want pictures, just hit me up. But you know, kind of shouting out. Uh, John Singleton, obviously, written and directed by him. Shout out some of the people in here, you know, Cube, Regina King, etc. <clears throat> but yeah, and it goes on and on and on. And then next up, you know, we're still in the same stuff. Boom, boom. Kind of giving a little uh, breakdown of all these people, you know, Tyra Banks in there too, etc. Boom about the filmmakers right there, and it goes on. You know, typical press kit stuff, if y'all haven't seen one. I do have a couple other press kit um, things on my YouTube channel, but then boom, more information. We got the cast, it goes on and on. I'm not gonna bore y'all with all of it. We're gonna get into some other stuff too. It's pretty cool too, like one thing that's pretty funny, you know, you got the production crew obviously, but then you got stuff right here, right here, like um, they show like the craft service, which I think is just funny. But it's cool too, because back in the day, like people, maybe they they liked the craft service on set and, and maybe like a homie or homegirl was like, hey, who's the craft services at higher learning? You know what I mean? And then, oh, they hit up John Starr right there. Boom, what up John Starr, you know, first aid, etc. So it's just pretty interesting. You got the music right here. I like the song Higher. Uh, produced by Sir Jinx, one of the greats. You got Situation Grim. I mean, you got, you know, the soundtrack situation, other songs that, you know, the soundtrack's whatever. It's not that great. Some standouts. And then it just goes on and on and on. You got the credits, boom, boom, whatever. So that's kind of like, you know, uh, that information right there, production notes, etc. a little bit of the plot, a little bit about the filmmakers, whatever. Then you got right here, you have the photos. So... <clears throat> this one right here, it's cool because it's stamped Columbia Pictures and Higher Learning. It's stamped, so this came in its original uh, packaging. Then here we have the actual photos, which are pretty cool. You know, you got scenes from the movie. This one, as you can see, the text kind of describing the scene during his freshman year. You know, Remy, a.k.a. Michael Rappaport, blah, blah. He's involved with the skinheads, whatever. So then that, you got that. Then you got here, you got... Regina King, you got Bus Rhymes in the back. It's funny how they sell Bus Rhymes with a Z. They clearly do not know who Bus Rhymes is because why would they spell his name wrong? But, you know, you got stuff like that. This one's cool because you got Omar Epps in there. You got Shorty. Boom. So shout out the Lynch Mob. You got Ice Cube. You got Bus Rhymes. And I actually have two of these because they gave me two. So I was very happy to have that. Pretty cool stuff. And you see a cube with the fro here. So um, as you can see here, it says copyright 1994. For y'all who remember Ice Cube in the lethal injection era, that was uh, 93. Um, and he also had a fro, so creeping into this movie as well. Then you got here, you got Lawrence Fishburne, you got Omar Epps. Um, you know, the campus tragedy, as they say, photo by Eli Reed, boom, boom. Got the same thing again. Like I said, I got doubles of some of this stuff because they hooked it up. And then right here, we got Omar Epps. Just posing a little bit, you know, he's just doing his thing. And then right here, this is Tyra Banks. Super, super, super young. Covering her forehead, you know how it goes. And boom, so these are the photos that I have. This is the press kit that I have for higher learning. I'm gonna go ahead and put this back. 
with y'all. Let me know if you want any more info on this. I always love little press kits and things like that um, on, you know, hip-hop cinema, hip-hop movies, especially Ice Cube being my personal favorite rapper. I like to get things from Ice Cube uh, in particular and learn more things that maybe I miss or whatever and just have these images. So hit me up on Instagram and TikTok. I rap it in snacking. Drop a comment. Like the stuff. Appreciate y'all as always. Turn on them notifications. And I will talk to y'all soon. Bless. Peace.